Hi everybody, today is Monday, May 4th, and in this science lesson, you are going to be taking the Unit 9 quiz. For today's lesson, you will need the science quiz, which is pages AG42 through AG45, and a pencil. So make sure you have all those items, and once you have those ready, then you'll be ready to begin. Here we are on page AG42, which is the first page of your um, quiz, and we should be looking at number one. Please make sure that your name is on the top of the test. All right, and I'm going to ask you the question, so you need to listen carefully, and then you will fill in the circle underneath the choice that best answers the question that I ask. Okay, so listen carefully. If you need to pause, you can pause at any time and press play whenever you're ready. Um, if you need to pause to fill in the answer before you go in, ahead to the next question, don't just fill in bubbles because you think that you know the answer. Go back and listen to the, to the question. I'm going to pause in between to make sure that I think you have enough time to answer, especially because I'm going to ask the question a couple times. Okay, so number one says, which thing can you use to make vibrations that make sound? Which thing can be used to make vibrations that make sound? Is that a book, a drum, or a lamp? Which can you use to make vibrations to make sound? Okay, number two. Which picture shows someone touching a body part that vibrates to make sound? Which picture shows someone touching a body part that vibrates to make sound? Do we touch our throat? Our throat to make sound? Do we touch our nose to make sound? Or do we touch our toes to make sound? Which body part do we touch to make sound? Throat, nose, or, whoops, or toes? All right, when you're finished, turn your paper to the next page. You should be looking at number three. Now you should be looking at page AG43. Number three is the first question that you see on this page. Okay, we're going to start right there at number three. And the question for number three is, which picture shows someone making vibrations that make a loud sound? Look at those three pictures. Which picture shows someone making vibrations that make a loud sound. Fill in the circle under that picture. Who's using vibrations to make a loud sound? All right, now down to number four. Which picture shows someone making vibrations to make a soft sound? Who's using vibrations to make a soft sound? Look at those three pictures. Is it the traffic conductor, the crying baby, or the boy whispering in the girl's ear? Who's using vibrations to make a soft sound? All right, number five. Number five says, which picture shows something making vibrations that make a high sound. Which picture shows something making vibrations that make a high sound? Fill in the circle under that picture. Who's making a high sound? 
Is it the boy on the drums, the girl taking a nap, or the boy at the end here? Who's making a high sound? Fill in the circle under the picture. When you're finished, turn to the next page. All right, boys and girls, now you should be on page AG44. And the first question on your page is number six. We're gonna start right there. And the question they're asking is, which picture shows something that gives off light? Which picture shows something that gives off light? Fill in the circle underneath that picture. Which, which picture shows something that gives off light? Okay, number seven. Which picture shows something that gives off heat? Which picture shows something that gives off heat? Is it a bell, a toaster, or a fork? Which one of those gives off heat? Fill in the circle underneath your answer. And number eight, which of these pictures shows something that gives off both light and heat? Which of those pictures shows something that gives off light and heat? Is it a campfire, a boy playing a horn, or a girl using a blow dryer? Something that gives off both light and heat. Fill in the circle underneath your answer. And when you're finished, turn to the last page and you should be looking at number nine. Here we are on the last page, AG45, and you should be looking at number nine. That's the first one on the top of your page, number nine. And the question for number nine is, which picture shows a source of sound energy? Which picture shows a source of sound energy? Is it a candle, a dog barking, or the light or heat from the sun? Which one of those pictures shows sound energy? Fill the circle underneath your answer. And number 10, our final question for our quiz <clears throat> is which picture shows a source of light energy? Which picture shows a source of light energy? Is that a girl playing the drums and singing? The boy using the toaster? Or the kids? using the flashlight to make shadow pictures. Who's using light energy? Please fill in the answer underneath the picture. And once you're finished, if you'd like, you may go and color your pictures if you choose. That's up to you, you don't have to. Uh, but once you're finished, please make sure that your name is on your paper and you are all finished with your science quiz for today. Bye, guys.